Creating our garage gym. Let me tell y'all, man, we've been going at it the last week. We added lights, we changed the lighting up in here, and we raised the garage doors up. I'm gonna show y'all, let's come here, come on, come on. Look, look, they close. Let me show y'all the lighting. The reason why we added the lighting, right, obviously we can use the natural light, but at night, it's gonna get really dark in here, so we added really cool lights. If we ever just wanna get a little crazy, oh, oh, we added the color lighting to that, made it look super sick. Then we added the garage doors, raising up. So now, when we're doing everything, you know, shoulder to overhead, ground to overhead, we can do, we can put literally everything up there. The next step, all this is about to be painted. It's gonna look sick. Baca barbell, about to get fucking swole. So the muralist is just about done doing his work, doing his thing with the Baca Rose. I'm gonna show you guys a sneak peek. I'm not gonna show you guys everything just yet. Wait till the end of the video for that. I kinda wanna take a peek at this. Supposedly, it's fucking insane. I haven't seen this before, so let me go in here for you. Oh, this way. <laughs> this is the guy, the boy Cruz. Oh my. Yo. <laughs> Holy shit. Bro, dude, I love the line work. I cannot wait to like put all the mats up and everything. Two days later. Time to like actually set up these mats. It's gonna take a minute. Let's do it. We got it all cleared out. We got all our crap out here. Now it's to figure out how we're gonna orientate these mats. There's 25. Each of those weighs 100 pounds. Bruh. All right, so what we're trying to do right now is figure out how to like make these mats stagger right without them having to move so much. We kind of have a somewhat idea of how we want to do this. We're hoping everything works out good. We'll see, we'll keep you guys up there. Let's go. Let's finish putting up the mats. It looks super messy right now. I'll save the big reveal for after when we clean it up, make it look nice. For the most part, it's kind of looking good. We got to mop everything. This whole place looks dope. I cannot wait to work out of here. Wait, you guys got mats in here too already? You got the fucking TV. Huh? Now all we need, which they're going to do today, is install the rigs. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we've been waiting Waiting for finally, finally, the Baca Bros Gym is ready. I'm excited to show y'all. Let's get it started, baby. So what we did, guys, one of the big things that we did was we moved our garage doors up. No longer, we moved these up a little bit. Let me show y'all, let me show y'all. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We pretty much changed all the recessed lightings on here. We changed, we added like 12 light bulbs. We painted this entire thing black and we wanted to recreate this picture right here. And we made this into the entire gym. Whenever we post videos, whenever we, you know, we post our PRs, things like that, we want this to be like, oh, that's the Baca Barbell Club right there, you know? Hey, so guys, look at our logo. Look at everything, man. Look how fucking crazy this came out. Oh my. God, bro. You can't tell me that don't look gas. You can't tell me that don't look gas. Baca Bros logo right here. We got the line work, bolt, everything bolt. We can custom painted all the rigs on here to be bolt. Same thing on this side. It's literally my dream gym. So let me walk you through every single piece in here and how we did it. We got an industrial fan. It is hot as hell in Texas. It's like 105 degrees right now. We got a Concept 2 rower right here. Obviously we got a TV if there's something we want to watch. We got the Rogue Echo Bike. If you guys ever want to like grow up, this right here is what you use. Then we got the bike or concept to biker. This thing quad burn like crazy. These are all our conditioning pieces. One last one right here is the concept to skier. I'm telling y'all, these actually make you gasp for air. You ask Hector, how you not get tired while DJing going crazy? It's because I kill myself here in conditioning to make sure that I'm able to DJ without gasping for air. This is a GHD setup. For anybody who doesn't know this, pretty much just a setup machine. Time set. You know what? Let me hop in. Let me, let me get Oh my God, he on X Games. This bro. thing, hey. You do like 20 of those, you're sore. I'm not kidding, 20 of those. <laughs> then we have one spot right here. We have all our dumbbells right here. I'm planning on, the only thing is, I wanna be like, be conscious of how much space we have in this garage. I like to have an open floor. I do wanna get the complete dumbbell set from five to 100. We have weighted vests. I think we have two of these. I don't know where the other one's at. We got the weighted vest. We have obviously weightlifting belts here. We have the belts that you attach weights to so you can do uh, weighted pull-ups and things like that. We have all these types of jump ropes. We have anything from speed ropes to weighted ropes. I put this off to the side. I guess I'll consider this like the weightlifting side of things. I, I don't know how you call it. It's like the, the third the third rack, right? These are the main ones over here, um, which we'll get to right now. We have a bunch of wall balls. We have 30, 20, and 14 pounds. And then we have sandbags, which I actually love these, they're really fun. We have a 100 pound sandbag right here in camo. And then we have the 150 pound sandbag. And like those things get really hard. Bruh, chill. And this right here is like my pride and joy. I love these. I am very using for squat rack. You can use it for pull ups. You can use it for benching. We have the bench right here, bro. I'm not gonna do it now, but if you wanna conserve space, you take these pins off and it folds 
into the wall. So now you have a complete garage set up. Anything you could possibly want to do, we have in here to do it. We got free weights. We got our barbells over here. Uh, we have, oh, pile box, pile box. You know how everybody's always getting like scabbed up on their, on their shins? We have these, which are like foam, but they're really heavy. And so if you do end up hitting your shins, it won't scratch you up. Our barbells, we have a bunch of different, we have like six or seven of them. Vogue. Um, Olympic weightlifting bar. So obviously they have different, use them for different reasons. This have a crazy knurling uh, for better grip. This has an all around knurling, better for like any type of movements all in one. This is just another crossfit bar. Um, we have a powerlifting bar, which has a center knurl, another rogue, just whatever bar. And then we have Ashley's blue girl bar. And I wish I had one of like pink, like a men's bar in pink, that'd be sick. I am literally obsessed with this gym. Look at this, look at that. We have a road clock up there, man. I am in love with this gym. I cannot wait to start grinding it out, you know? But listen, let me know what y'all think down below. Maybe some workout streams, workout videos. If you guys want them, we can make it happen with all the boys. We can do like challenges against each other. See who can lose the most weight in like 30 days or gain the most muscle in 30 days or 90 days, whatever it may be, man. I'm excited to make this thing happen. I'm excited to start giving you guys more content, not just Call of Duty, not just vlogs. We want to branch out into other things like this. So if you guys like the home gym, let me know. I love this thing, man. It, this gym is literally everything I ever wanted it to be. Sexies, y'all know I love the CDL. So listen, Card Champs is live right now. August 4th through the 7th, the action is happening now. Listen, go and get your tickets. If you're in LA, stop by Card Champs. I will be there this Sunday streaming from the event. I swear, if y'all see me, y'all better say what's up. So listen, make sure guys to tune into youtube.com slash to watch it right now. I'm telling y'all, you won't wanna miss it.